Our nerves transmit signals at incredibly high speeds, some reaching up to 250 miles per hour. Our nervous system comprises billions of specialized cells, constantly transmitting messages and ensuring that we can move, speak, see, hear, touch, and feel what we feel. However, there are many things around us, or many things that we do that can damage our nerves. These factors include aging, taking too much stress, not getting enough sleep, unhealthy diet, and even spending too much time glued to screens. All these factors can lead to neuropathy, which is arguably the most common nerve-related problem worldwide. In fact, it has been estimated that about 20 million people are affected by different forms of nerve damage in the U.S. alone. Diabetic people in particular have a higher risk of developing neuropathy than others, diabetic neuropathy to be more specific. But don't worry, because in today's episode, we'll learn about some of the most essential vitamins whose deficiency can potentially cause nerve damage or symptoms of neuropathy. Let's begin. Number 1. Vitamin B1. Vitamin B1, also known as thiamine, is one of the most essential vitamins for nerve health. In fact, a critical deficiency in thiamine can cause peripheral neuropathy, showing up in symptoms like numbness or tingling in the hands or feet, sharp or burning pains, sensitivity to touch, muscle weakness, muscle cramps, problems with keeping the body's balance, slow reflexes, and so many others. But when you take enough thiamine with your diet, it helps your body to repair and regenerate nerve cells, especially where nerve damage is due to nutritional deficiencies, such as in alcoholic neuropathy or beriberi. Moreover, in conditions like diabetic neuropathy, where nerves are damaged due to high blood sugar levels, thiamine helps alleviate the symptoms of neuropathy by improving glucose metabolism and supporting overall nerve function. In fact, thiamine is a key component in the production of adenosine triphosphate, which our body produces from sugars and acts as the primary energy currency of cells. So without enough of this energy, your nerve cells may not function properly or get damaged. Thiamine is also essential for the production of neurotransmitters, such as acetylcholine. This neurotransmitter is critical for proper muscle function and nerve signaling. So how can you get enough vitamin B1? Well, that's easy. You can take it from a balanced diet containing whole grains, lean meats, nuts, and legumes. But if you have neuropathy, and it's because of vitamin B1 deficiency, then you must consider taking vitamin B1 supplements as recommended by your healthcare professional. Number 2. Vitamin B6 Vitamin B6, also known as pyridoxine, is a water-soluble vitamin that plays a crucial role in various processes in the body, including amino acid metabolism, neurotransmitter synthesis, and overall nerve health. It is essential for preventing nerve damage and maintaining proper nerve function. Vitamin B6 acts as a coenzyme in the production of neurotransmitters, including serotonin, dopamine, and GABA. These neurotransmitters are mainly related to mood regulation and stress reduction. So vitamin B6 helps ensure that you stay in a good mood, more focused, and able to make decisions quickly and efficiently. Vitamin B6 is also necessary for the metabolism of amino acids, which are the building blocks of proteins. They are crucial for the maintenance and repair of nerve tissues. In fact, if you don't obtain enough vitamin B6 from your diet or supplements, it can lead to peripheral neuropathy, which, as you know, shows up in symptoms like numbness, tingling, and burning sensations in hands or feet. Conversely, excessive intake of vitamin B6 can also be problematic. Prolonged intake of very high doses can lead to neuropathy too, and cause irreversible nerve damage. This is why it's important to stay within recommended daily intake levels. Now, the recommended daily intake for vitamin B6 varies with age, sex, and life stage. For most adult men and women, the recommended daily intake is around 1.3 to 1.7 milligrams per day. You can easily take enough vitamin B6 through a balanced diet. Foods rich in vitamin B6 include eggs, bananas, salmon, avocado, spinach, chickpeas, pistachios, and lean meats. Number 3. Vitamin B12 First off, vitamin B12 is essential for nerve cell maintenance. It helps build the protective layer around your nerves called myelin sheath. Without this sheath, your nerves can get damaged and messages can get mixed up or lost. And that's when you might start feeling the symptoms of neuropathy. Vitamin B12 is also involved in the production of DNA, 
the genetic material of your cells. Nerve cells, in particular, need a lot of DNA action to stay healthy and repair themselves. So having enough B12 helps ensure that your nerve cells can regenerate and stay in good shape. Now, to make sure you're not facing nerve issues, you gotta get your B12. You can find it in foods like meat, fish, eggs, and dairy products. If you're not getting enough through your diet, your doctor might recommend B12 supplements to keep your nerves in good shape. Number 4. Vitamin E. Free radicals form as byproducts of normal metabolism, like when your body breaks down food and synthetic chemicals in it. They can also form in response to environmental factors like pollution and UV radiation. When left unchecked, free radicals can damage the structure and function of nerve cells, a process known as oxidative stress, and that can potentially damage your nerve cells, leading to the development of neuropathy. But vitamin E is a powerful antioxidant, meaning it helps neutralize those bad free radicals, which in turn helps prevent or alleviate neuropathic symptoms. Now the myelin sheath is a protective covering that surrounds and insulates nerve fibers, much like the insulation around electrical wires. This sheath is crucial for the efficient transmission of nerve signals. Vitamin E helps maintain the integrity of the myelin sheath, ensuring it remains intact and effective. Vitamin E also supports the overall health of nerve cells. It contributes to the maintenance and repair of these cells, helping them recover from damage and stay in optimal condition. You can obtain enough vitamin E from various dietary sources. Foods rich in vitamin E include nuts like almonds and hazelnuts, seeds such as sunflower seeds, spinach, broccoli, avocado, and minimally processed vegetable oils such as extra virgin olive oil. Number 5. Vitamin D. There are two primary forms of vitamin D, vitamin D2 and vitamin D3. Vitamin D3 is the form that's naturally produced in the skin when it's exposed to sunlight and is also found in many animal-based foods. Vitamin D2 is a more synthetic form of vitamin D and is usually extracted from plant sources and supplements. Now, vitamin D, specifically in the form of vitamin D3, plays a major role in preventing nerve damage and repairing your nerves. It supports the overall health and integrity of nerves through several mechanisms. First, it helps to regulate calcium levels in your body, which is crucial for nerve function. This helps to prevent calcium-related nerve damage. Vitamin D3 also supports the maintenance and repair of the myelin sheath, helping to ensure its integrity. It also has anti-inflammatory properties and helps normalize your immune system's response. In conditions where nerve damage is associated with inflammation, such as autoimmune disorders, vitamin D3 helps bring down inflammation and reduce nerve damage. The recommended daily intake of vitamin D can vary based on age, sex, and specific health needs. For most adults, the recommended daily intake of vitamin D is around 600 to 800 international units. The most natural way to obtain vitamin D is through sunlight exposure. However, it may be difficult for you to get all the vitamin D you need from sunlight alone, as the amount of vitamin D depends on factors like skin tone, geographic location, time of day, and sunscreen use. But don't worry, vitamin D is also naturally present in many healthy foods, such as fatty fish, like salmon and mackerel, cod liver oil, and egg yolks. But if you are a vegan or vegetarian, then you must consider taking vitamin D3 supplements as per the advice of your health expert. Make sure to like this video and subscribe to the channel to support our mission to help improve your health. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.